So we're in CapCut and I'm going to open up some stock material over here and we're going to just use something that they have available. We're going to zoom, we're going to zoom into our video. I'm going to show you a bunch of ways to, to do that zoom. So let's just uh, open up our, our track a little bit and you can see this is what it sort of looks like. Now that's without the zoom effect. There's a few ways you can actually zoom in CapCut. So the first way is something that I use very little. If you use the effect panel on the top left, you'll actually be able to find a zoom. There's an optical zoom and then there's a mini zoom. And the mini zoom, and it just it doesn't make any sense. So what you do here is you click down, you drag it, and you put it onto your video clip. So you can see, you push play, it's got that that zoom vibe going on right the thing is there's very little control that you have so you can you can change the speed and the strength of the optical zoom and really that's not like really what we want we want full control so there are more ways of doing it you can um once you've got your clip you go over to the right hand side and you're going to go and look for animation here you can you can choose animations um, in and out. So let's just say we're going in and we're going to do um, the mini zoom or uh, the zoom out. So you can see that uh, you can change the duration here as well. So let's say we want to make it like four seconds all the way in. So can you see that it's now zooming out, right? Um, the zoom two actually does a zoom in. And that's also sort of like does like a weird there's there's a bunch of different zoom effects so you can use this one as well that's going to do that sort of thing but again you know you, you we haven't really got a lot of control in terms of what we're actually doing here so we're not going to use these we're going to go ahead and we're going to use we're going to do manual zooms right so just make sure that your clip is selected and what we're going to do is we can now clip this and have it zoom at different times so the first thing you want to do is go on the right hand side under transform and scale we are going to add a keyframe now here at 100 percent is what you're physically seeing right now um, your video is zoomed in 100 percent. so this is basically your fit to screen and let's say we want to push play and we want this clip to be sort of stopped there Okay, and here we're going to enter in another um, keyframe, but we're not going to tap on the keyframe. We are going to change the zoom that we want, right? So let's say at this point we want we want this to look like like this. Okay, that's like all the way in. Let's just for example sake like 160. Now it has already created one of those keyframes. Let's see what it looks like. So basically what is happening is it is it is zooming in from zero to this point here, right? And what we can do is we can change this so it's a little bit it's a little bit different. So let's say 120, you can see again it is zooming in. Let's say we'd like to zoom out, we can do the exact same thing. So we're gonna go over to that to that frame where your zoom your keyframe is and we're going to make it 100 and we're going to go back to here to the very first frame of the video and we're going to make this uh, 140 and you can see the effect again now that's zooming out right so that's one way and there is infinite amounts of um keyframes that you can add in here so you know we've added a keyframe in here and this is it here so let's say like just over here we would like to add another keyframe in we are going to make it so 130 and let's say just about over here we want to make this uh, we're going to zoom it all the way out let's make it like 80 okay and this is what it's going to look like so it's zooming now out and on the right hand side you can see it 
each frame what the zoom rate is or what the scale rate is. And that's actually what's happening to it now. So if you want to use your zoom effects, you can actually just use the keyframes instead of splitting your um, clips so that you can get proper zoom effects so that it slides in and slides out.